Venezuelan presidential candidate Edmundo Gonzalez has fled to Spain in the latest development since Venezuela's highly contested and controversial presidential election. Many Western countries, including the United States, sees Gonzalez as the true winner, but its authoritarian president, Nicolas Maduro, claimed victory and in the wake of upheaval and protests over the results, ordered for his opposition to be arrested. Just days after an arrest warrant was issued for Gonzalez, he landed at a military airport near Madrid on Sunday following a negotiated deal with Maduro's government, allowing him to flee his home country to avoid charges of conspiracy. Since the election more than a month ago, Gonzalez has been in hiding as authorities have rounded up thousands of people, including hundreds of minors, arresting those protesting Maduro's claimed victory. After arriving in Spain, Gonzalez sent a voice message to his supporters saying, My departure from Caracas was surrounded by acts of pressure, coercion, and threats. I trust that we will soon continue our fight to achieve our freedom and the restoration of Venezuela's democracy. Another major opposition leader and ally to Gonzalez, Maria Karina Machado, posted on X. On January 10, 2025, President-elect Edmundo Gonzalez will be sworn in as constitutional president of Venezuela and commander-in-chief of the National Armed Forces. Let this be very clear to everyone. Edmundo will fight from the outside. However, the decision to depart from Venezuela has stoked fear in some of his supporters. One telling the Associated Press, what little hope we had left went with him. Gonzalez isn't alone in fleeing Venezuela after running against the single party regime that has ruled the country for more than two decades. Four other former presidential hopefuls who were sent to prison or faced arrest have also fled for their safety. Maduro's government has yet to provide any proof of its victory, but voter tally sheets collected by Gonzalez shows him winning by a more than two to one margin, leading countries like the U.S. to deem Gonzalez the true winner of Venezuela's election in what has become a saga over election integrity. Thanks for watching our news update. We will continue to follow any developments out of Venezuela. Stay connected with Straight Arrow News by downloading our mobile app or visit us at san.com.